Hey guys, Beats here, and guess what I have? Loot anime! So, obviously, I forgot the theme, like everything else, and you are joining me for the unboxing. Um, I also realized that I totally forgot to grab some scissors, so give me a moment, I have a pin. I have a pin. <laughs> for some reason, this box is smaller than the others. Wow. I have one for comparison, but it's actually holding up my mic right now because I realize a lot of times in my videos you guys hear very little or you'll hear like it sounds like I'm far away or there's a weird echo. That's actually because I have it set down on the floor. I don't have an actual couch or a chair that I record on, so it's always on the floor like I am now. Also why I have to get up and wander around sometimes. <gasps> By the way, y'all can hate, but I love Ghost in the Shell, and I love Scarlett Johansson. She's my bitch. So, I can't wait for the movie. Now, why am I saying this? Because in this lovely, lovely one, Ghost in the Shell, Arise. Oh, man. Will it fit my boobs? I don't, I don't know. You'll figure that out later. No, I'll figure it out now. Okay. Watch me, B. Watch me. Watch your glasses. Okay. Watch my hair clip. That's the other thing you have to worry about. Oh my god, the boobs. So, when you fat, you have many roles. I think I might need to use the other way. I don't want to wear it anyways. It's not flattering, but... Nah, it's Yoshi time. <laughs> Cat's just hanging out over there like, woo! <gasps> also, one of my other favorite animes. Um, can you see it okay? Cycle Pass! So he has a T, like the T logo on his cardigan. That's not the T logo. I said it looks like. From, from <laughs> yes, he works for the MBTA, and that makes this anime so fucked up then. <laughs> so what Psycho Pass is about is they have these little guns, and they evaluate your likelihood to commit a crime. Um, if you are more likely to commit a crime, like you're in a moment of panic, and all of a sudden it's like, oh, they might commit a homicide. Then it basically sets from stun to kill. Yes, Kitty, I'm, I'm, get over here. <laughs> okay, we can sit over here. Okay. But, um, so it goes from stun to kill. Within the first episode, you actually find a moment where this woman is kidnapped by this guy that they're trying to catch, and because she's basically being, like, near raped, that she is completely like panicked like oh my god i hate myself that type of thing and so it goes to a little evaluation of suggested kill and you find the protagonist doesn't want to do this she's like we can talk her down we can talk her down and that basically lets her stun her instead so it's actually really cool um and also if that's an mbta logo that's also really fucking weird I'm just saying, from my distance through the camera, it looked like. Oh, I know. It just also is funny. Okay. Baby. <laughs> but, so, this is actually a 2 gig USB flash drive. 2 gigs are a thing, guys. Back in my day, you used to pay over $100 for this. He's not enthused. <laughs> and this is the gun that they use. So sometimes I will go on my eBay profile and sell these guys, the ones that I don't like or I don't care for, just to make a little bit of extra cash because I have a blind diabetic cat with needs and it's expensive. <laughs> but um, it's a high rascal. this one I think I'm definitely keeping for myself as soon as I figure out, oh, there it is. I don't know what I'll save because yeah, but check it out. Pretty awesome, huh? 
It's like really fucking cool. If I can get it back in there. Phrasing, I know, I know. <laughs> Shut you. <clears throat> now, that being said, what else we've got is Clockwork Planet. So, let me just read the back because I don't know this one. Naoto is a brilliant amateur mechanic who spends his days tinkering with gears and inventions, and his world is a playground, a massive, intricate machine. But his quiet life is disrupted when a box containing an automaton in the shape of a girl crashes into his home. Could this be an omen of a breakdown in Naoto's delicate clockwork planet, and is this his chance to become a hero? AKA, I like girls, I like robots. Suddenly, robot girl. My life went cray. So this is another one of the phone charms that Lou Anime gives you. Not sure what the theme was, can't remember. Really can't remember. This one is probably one I'm gonna be selling. By the way guys, if you ever wanna check it out, it's a Rare Vox. I will type it up in the description for you um, on eBay. But it looks like Kiz... Kizniver? Kizniver? Why are they all different colors? Why is her hair weird? Anyways, it is a mouse pad. If you guys know what this is about, let me know in the description, not in the description, but um, in the comments because I like checking out new anime, obviously, and I'm always welcome to learning more. <clears throat> and maybe this will give me an idea of what is going on here. Oh, here we go, here we go. So every time they send out a large poster with basically their little mascot doing their own thing based on, well, based on their theme. <clears throat> so this theme is actually future. So we had the Ghost in the Shell Arise t-shirt, You Made Together Charm, Kiznaiver Mouse Pad, Psychopath Dominator USB, and Clockwork Planet Volume 1 Manga. Let me know if you got it okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. So yeah, this was last month's, aka this month's, um, Loot Crate. If you guys like watching unboxings for some reason, I still don't understand why. Let me get the... Get the... I like this box. Oh, no, it's an awesome box. I'm keeping it. I mean, we might need it for shipping, but still. <laughs> it's a cool box. But um, if you guys like unboxing stuff, there's a couple other videos up on my channel. Um, I get loot anime. My roommate, Tova, who's recording this, <laughs> gets normal loot crates. Um, she's a big comic book Marvel type girl, so a lot of her stuff is going to be geared towards that. If she ever unboxes like a random crate that's like Marvel, because they do let you buy things on their own. And now I'm just talking and talking and talking. So I have 29 videos to edit from an eight hour playthrough of Kingdom Hearts. So, needs out. <laughs>